Let me take you through the interface of the master terminal application and show main functionality. If you are running the application for the first time, you may want to change view settings. You can select a simple scale preset or try advanced design customization. User profiles keep connection, language and view saved settings. Language support is done mostly with Google Translator, so be careful. The help page provides some connection troubleshooting. The main settings are quite standard. The paths down below are needed for update and bootloader procedures. The most important settings are the device modes here. The firmware architecture is all about these modes. To avoid conflicts, disable what you don't really need. For example, you want to play Trace, disable Gateway. Message play uses timestamps from the trace, but actual maximum speed is limited by USB connection. If the timestamps rate exceeds USB capability, a play session is slowed down. Use auto for maximum possible speed or set a delay manually. As long as trace play is buffered, it doesn't start or stop immediately. monitor with the cell phone, it is recommended to use hardware filter to reduce COM port payload.
custom bitrate if you use a speed different than 500 kilobits per second. Override filters work together with the calibrator function. What is a calibration function? It is a custom procedure that makes changes to a data flow. For example, this is a demo of commercial version that multiplies auto and speedo readings.